Hi, my name's Clint Hastings. I'm an attorney here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and I focus on father's rights. Today, I want to answer the question that I get a lot, and that's, can I pay for an attorney out of marital funds once the divorce is filed, filed or before the divorce? So here's the deal. What happens is when you file for a petition, the court clerk will issue what's called an automatic temporary injunction. That's an injunction placed on every case by statute of things you cannot do and how certain things must be handled before the judge is able to give you further orders in the case. One of those things is uh, how do I use marital funds when needed for things such as an attorney? And it specifically states, and I'll read it from the statute, that selling, mortgaging, encumbering, transferring, loaning, giving away, concealing, or in any way disposing of without the written consent of the other party or an order of the court in any marital property except, and the second one down is, for the purpose of retaining an attorney for the case. So you can use them in that instance. However, another provision that's put into this automatic temporary injunction is that you need to account for them. And what that means is you need to write down specifically how much, where, when, how, what for you use those funds for. So you're not going to conceal it from the court. You're going to have to account for it, but you can do that. I hope this helps. Read over the site. If you have questions, let us know and we'll try to answer them. Thanks.